here is our Xperia 10 and our Xperia 10 Plus. These are our, our new mid-range devices. Both, as you can see, have a 21 by 9 wide screen, which is great for multitasking and immersive streaming, uh, immersive entertainment. Um, both devices support uh, 4K video recording in 21 by 9, as well as um, picture, still picture taking as well in 21 by 9. Um, they have Qualcomm 630 processor, a Qualcomm 636 processor. Um, both have 64 gigabyte um, internal memory in board. The X10 has 3 gigabyte RAM. The X10 Plus has 4 gigabyte RAM. Both can be extended to 256, uh, oh, no, 512 gigabyte of RAM. Um, what is new on both of our devices is that we now have dual cameras. Um, the X10 has a, uh, yep, the Xperia 10 has a 12, 13 megapixel uh, main camera and a 5 megapixel bokeh depth camera, where um, the, X10, uh, the Xperia 10 Plus has a 12 megapixel camera as main camera and an 8 megapixel camera for bokeh and for optical zoom. Both devices have a stylish uh, body, sleek body uh, design. And uh, this is plastic with metallic finish. And both devices have a uh, Gorilla Glass 5. What we mean with uh, intuitive with simple UI, we make it easy for users to use multi-screen. If you tap here, this application, uh, the side sense window opens, but you can use it as well here. You swipe up and the side sense window will open. We had this introduced in our XZ3 flagship product and we now introduced it on our mid-tier devices. So it's very simple, you tap here and it will go, here you have your um, album and then you type here and here you have your messages. Now when you see here in the album you can scroll through and you can start a video. So here you have your video. It's a still picture. I'm looking for the video. Ah, uh, there you go. So here you have your video. You can see, you can watch your video. And now you can type your text. So that's one of the big advantages of a 21 by 9 display. If you have an 18 by 9, 16 by 9 display, you wouldn't see the top of the screen, even if you have split screen support. And um, again, it's very simple if you want to um, I open it again. So here, very intuitive, you don't have to think a lot. You see now you have your split screen. And again, if you want to change the split screen, you just open up and we have here, it's called swap window. You type here and then you see it swaps the window. So we just want to be very user friendly to make it very simple for the users to use split screen and to have all the benefits from 21 by 9. And 21 by 9 content is available, for example, on Netflix. Um, we have the Netflix application pre installed. And um, to show you an example, so here you see here you see a 4K a 4K video in action. Uh, <laughs> not a 4K video, but a 21 by 9 video in action. So you see it's using the whole screen. Yeah. And um, if you have 16 by 9 content, then what we what feature we have, hang on. So here. Example, it's not truly, truly 16 by 9, but just to give you an example, what you can do, you can pinch and zoom. Okay. So yes, you might lose here some on the edges, but you can still use the full screen. So basically we making the best out of 21 by 9. And of course, what is very, um, what is you very user friendly? You can use it with one hand. You must not forget this is a 6.5 inch screen, so it's a large screen, but it's easy to hold in the hand. You can double tap as well here, so it's getting smaller, and then you double tap back here, and then it's going back. Okay, very curious. Okay, thank you very, very much for explanation. <laughs>